His Morning Crew with Rob, Allison, and Jim. A couple years ago, my son Sammy was uh, dressed up as a mailman. And I thought it would be really fun to take him to the post office to do a little photo shoot. And we did, and it was super fun. So this year, Sammy decided he wants to be an airport ground crew member. So I bought, like, this reflective vest off Amazon and those little wands, you know, that light up that the airport, they direct the planes. I got him those, and he already had, like, the noise-canceling headphones, and I made him, like, a security badge. It looked so cute. So I thought, this would be so fun to take him to the airport for a little photo shoot. And I was just imagining going to like baggage claim or maybe going to where there's a fence with airplanes behind him. But then I remembered I have a friend of a friend who is a canine officer at the airport and I just shot him a text message. I said, look, my son wants to be a ground crew member. Uh, I'd love to take some pictures. Can you uh, let come us on. come? You got in. Well, yes. He said, oh, he said come on, I'll help you. So we get there. I still had no idea what we, was in store for us. They hook us up with Delta, this guy that works at Delta. He take We bypass security we go like on the tarmac we're like driving around in the luggage carts um sammy got to direct a plane like to the gate uh he helped with the baggage he did all of this stuff i mean it was unreal it was the experience of a lifetime he got to uh inspect the emergency exits do the walk around of the plane he was thrilled to talk on the wonky tonky that's what he calls the wonky wonky tonky i love that (laughs) And he was like fist bumping his co-workers. He even went into the cockpit of the plane and talked to the captain. I'm just seeing everything. Everything is going into heaven. All right, let's go. Here they go. He said, everything's good in the hairplane. He always says hairplane. Um, so he got this flight off to Atlanta four minutes early, everybody. Hey, Sammy. Yeah. So, and the funny thing was, I was down there taking all these pictures. I was going nuts, of course. A friend texts me while I'm down there. She's like, my husband's on that plane. And he looked out the window and saw <laughs> Sammy on the tarmac. Wow. <laughs> you know, I wish I was a kid again and Allison was my mom. <laughs> All these cool things that you do. Oh, this was, I mean, we had no idea they were going to go above and beyond like they did. I mean, Delta was just incredible to do this. They even treated him to free Chick-fil-A. His new friend Dan says that when Sammy turns 18 to call him up and he'll give him a job. So I'm hey. like, hey, yeah, let's Our, do this. The resume is already being built. <laughs> wow, thank God he didn't want to be a pilot. Yeah, landed, right? Landing a plane. So this must have impressed you. It really did. And, you know, at first he was overwhelmed. I mean, it, like he, he didn't have any chance to prepare himself for this because I didn't know it was happening either. So he, you know, cried a little bit when they were like, hey, you want to do this? And he, no, I don't want to, I don't want to. And so I had to give him a little pep talk. And then once he... He hit his stride, though. Man, he was, they kept saying, he's like our best employee. That's so (laughs) cool and crazy. You know what? I went, okay, you can join in the conversation along with us at 800-447-7234. Tell us about a time when your kid impressed you. Like Sammy impressing Allison and Tim. I mean, come on. <laughs> My mom's going to be going. Yeah, I'm sure she will. All the stories that she has to tell. Those are different kind of stories, dude. Oh, yeah. So tell us about a time when your kid impressed you.